Good day, good day! How the fuck are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right, here we are, one on Wednesday with the big one. Hey, talking about one, give me big one, big one thumbs up, will you? Uh, today we're going to be talking about uh, this bugger again. Yeah, well, maybe not exactly this one. Oh, man, we got to turn on some lights. This baby is not lit up. We got to turn on some lights. Sorry about that. Get the lights going here. All right, yeah, we're going to be talking about the Matchbox Land Rover, the uh, 2020 Land Rover Defender 90. And uh, you're saying, Dano, it's a one-off Wednesday. What are we talking about this for? Well, I'll tell you what, ladies and gentlemen. Bam! Yeah, we're going to be talking about this one, the recolor from Matchbox. Now, um, I think uh, this just came out in the last uh, case. And what I don't know if they really do a case count or what. Yeah, this is what GVX and this is HFP. So this is a later later case. These are um, uh, I I had to buy this one in uh, off of eBay because I wanted to do a review on the new color. Um, these uh, are are in my Dollar General and and I I haven't seen one at Walmart yet but the Dollar Tree and stuff like that. So they are out there. Uh, I haven't quite uh, hit up any Walmarts recently, but uh, on my die cast uh, uh, groups in the area, uh, Hot Wheels are making their way out, but uh, I don't know about too many of the uh, Matchbox and if it is this case uh, that has the uh, blue recolor of that. So this is my one and only, and as you guys all know, um, I usually hesitate in opening them. <laughs> but for you, on a one-off Wednesday, we're gonna open this bugger up. How's that, yeah? That sounds like a deal. All right, let me uh, go. I'm sorry I'm off camera here, but I gotta get my knife off the edge of the uh, counter here so I can uh, get my big fat hand off the side so I can get right to the edge of the card so I can kind of uh, make a nice little slit there see we just make a little opening so if I do want to I can put it back in there but uh, we're not going to do that we're going to take this bugger out all right here we go Come on, D90. All right. We got to stop and put that up there. All right, here it is. Ba bam Look at that, baby. I am seeing it for the first time like you are out of the package. This is great. This is glorious. This is grand. All right. Looks like the same kind of uh, deco and things like that. It's just kind of uh, the same, you know, it's the same vehicle. So we're going to not have anything you know uh different per se other than the color now i like it that they do do recolors uh i've talked a little bit about this on this channel buying uh, things like in white or in black because you can see more of the details sometimes and uh you know things like that so uh once again let's just go through the bottom here 2020 Land Rover Defender. Uh, this was last year. Uh, it was put out, so actually it comes out in uh, uh, 2021. Now this is uh, the date of this uh, video is 2022, but so you know with the thing. So anyway, first off, I want to see if we can show this is a metallic light blue. It is a very, very nice light blue. Um, the camera seems to be showing it a little bit darker than it really is. But it's a nice, I would call it a nice baby blue color. Yeah. So I don't know if my can get the lighting to look maybe a little bit better at it. But that's the way cameras go. So, all right, let's grab this uh, green one. 
And let's do some comparing, okay? Looks like the front end's the same. Yeah, same headlights, badge on the grill, and that does say Defender across the nose. Now, on the real ones, these uh, checkered, and they're urban checkered, uh, checker plating, urban I like to call them, because on the real ones, uh, checker plating is usually uh, square boxes with hash marks in it. Well, Land Rover has taken off, off the uh, sharp edge of the checker plating and made them uh, more rounded edges. So that kind of is kind of stylish that way. Obviously, they're using the same wheel. Uh, this is what I would call, <clears throat> excuse me, <clears throat> just ate supper, so I'm kind of frogging it up a little bit. Anyway, just uh, this is, I call these the traditional Land Rover wheels. Yeah, these are the best wheels that they make, uh, and they are great. So once again, you can see that they do do some side deco. Is that true? No, no, that's just the shadow. I thought they did a, a door handle pass, but it's not. It's uh, it's just plain body. Very good color. These lighter colors tend to, um, you know, bleed, I would say, in the nicks and crannies or on the seam lines. They can kind of get kind of light. Uh, so, yeah, it's, it's, it's really kind of cool. Nice coverage there. I'm going to say that in the future, these corners on our Matchbox Defenders from days gone by, these corners would really get nicked up. They would almost be nicked up in the package. But this is a little bit more protected. As you see, maybe this way, we got a little bit of a lip on that rear bumper, and it kind of curves in. So I don't think we're going to see a lot of these in the future in plate condition with chips on those edges. But if it's going to chip anywhere, that would be the first place to go. All right, backside. Very, very nice. You can see the difference how color makes in, in uh, you know, showing off the details. You know, you kind of, you know, like that green, that handle really shows up a lot better than the blue. But once again, we have the Defender on the lower left there, and then the Land Rover badge on the right side. Very nice, very nice. And I don't know if you guys noticed this or not, but that rear, um, the rear window has a little wiper on it. You can't quite see it because of the spare tire, but there is a little wiper in there. I'm going to see if we can zoom in a little bit so we can see some of those details. Can you see it there? Now the light's hitting it. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Gas filler cap there. Seems like those um, side mirrors are back a little bit farther. It kind of looks kind of odd, but I, I, I think that's right. <laughs> I'm not an expert on these new dogs, so... Yeah, it's kind of kind of neat. Yeah. So there you go. Top looks pretty nice. Textured plastic windows. And uh, this will have an interior like we saw before. Let's see if we can zoom out here just a little bit. Get back to our regular scheduling programming. So as you guys know, I'm, I made a convertible of one. And that's what the interior looks like. I don't think... Um, let's see, that interior is all by itself. It doesn't share any body molding or anything like that. The, yes, it does. Doesn't it? Boy, now I don't. Okay, now we got to look. We got to look. We got to tear this part. Nope, nope. Yeah, yeah. So the interior is the trim piece and the bumpers. Yeah, so the, the base is just the base. Yeah, it's just very, very bare bones. So yeah, so... The interior on this vehicle is going to be that gray color. And uh, yeah, so then and then with the, the, the roof and the windows being the same. And if you get one of these buggers and you hold it up to the sunlight, you can see the interior. Yes, you can. So there you go. Oh, I, I, can't, I can't leave with my, 
my little arts and craft project all tore apart here. We got, bear with me. <laughs> we got to put that bugger back together. There it is. Quick look. Look, and we'll have the, we'll probably tag the video at the end, but uh, there you go. All right, that's it. A look of the new recolored 2020 Defend, Land Rover Defender 90. She's a keeper. All right, that's it for a one up win day. Thank you very much for following me today. Make sure you hit the subscribe button, share, and give me a thumbs up. All right, this is your friend Dano, and I'm out of here. Remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great Rover Day!